What's up, guys? We are back here with a back here with another Roblox Obi, and today we are here with Escape the iPhone. So today, ah, sorry, I got kind of like a ah something on the roof of my mouth. Anyway, yeah, we're here with the Escape the iPhone Obi. Doesn't like really hurt. It's like just a thing. And I've beaten some pretty hard Obi, so this shouldn't be too hard. I don't know how big it is, but we did the entire Escape the Meme Obi. If you guys remember that video, it took us like an hour and 11 minutes. It was pretty funny. Can't believe I sat through that whole thing. Come on. I seriously can't though. That was amazing. It makes me think I can do the entire Mega Fun Obi in one video, which I probably could if I had time. But I do have a life. I can't be playing giant Obi's like. I don't know, it's just mega fun if he gets a bunch of levels added to and it's just like, really? So I guess it's like actual jumping inside of an iPhone. If that's, that's what I'm guessing here. Jumping on iPhone type shit. Angry Birds, computer chips, and I guess that was battery acid back there. I don't know. Let's see. Yeah, that looks like battery acid. I'm not sure what the heck this is. The mid oh god. It's the middle one. It's the middle one. There's this one and I'm pretty sh <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's over here. Yes. I have a good thing for guessing those. Then I'm not sure what the crap these are. Assorted tiles. I'm guessing. Okay. Maybe I shouldn't have done it that way. Okay, fine. Come on, give me a challenge. Seriously, I need a challenge. I'm checking the chat because some. Oh, god damn it! Fucking. My dog just. Back kicked me in the crotch. Didn't feel too good. I swear if you do it again. Rip your head off. Nobody wants their head ripped off. 
Don't mess with me. <laughs> There's a guest trying to do it. Why did he jump back? He jumped back. And then he jumped back again. Okay, now he's doing it. Crazy, but want to chat, maybe? Okay. What's this, like a charging cable? Yeah, it's a charging cable. I remember there was a scene like this, and uh, if you guys ever played the original Max Payne, there was a scene like this where you had to walk across the thin narrow line in the baby's room. It was pretty difficult, and then I think the second worst part of that game was the scene where there's there's things in the elevator shaft, the explosives, and you gotta shoot them before the elevator hits them. And then the last one was where you were escaping that base. And everything exploded. And you had to get out. That was a pretty annoying part. Come on! I hate these narrow paths. They're like... Really hard. Gotta concentrate. God. Looks like we got some really thin jumps over there too. And a thin girl. Ah! Yeah, the younger viewers that totally went over their head. Come on, you almost have it. You're right there. There we go. Now you got it. Come on, she keeps dying on this? On this? Really? Oh no, not one of these. Oh dear lord, not one of these. Oh, I hate these. Oh no. 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 Why? Why one of these? Why couldn't you just make me jump over more stuff? Why did you make me have to do one of these? This is one of my least favorite things to do in an Obi. These things. Oh, they're so horrible. You'll die like 900 times before you can actually get it. Oh, and it curves around, seriously. What happens if we don't jump? Will we live? No. Look at that, my foot isn't, isn't even touching.
Low dog. I swear. Get a hold of your shit. Get a hold of it. Okay, we broke a new record. This is the farthest we've been. We're on the new heights now. Why did I pick this Obi? Maybe I should buy the boom box. It'll soothe me. Why don't they have a fidget spinner? I want a fidget spinner. I swear if she pushes me. Who is a god? Who is a god? Oh, did you just see that skills? Oh my god. Are you seeing these skills? Yes. These skills are mad. My god. Come on. Okay, now that that annoying sequence is over with, we are going to jump and jump some more. You gotta... You gotta get to the end. Let's see, where is she? Oh, she's jumping down there. Surely I can beat this before she catches up to me. I got quite a few obstacles behind me. Although I did blow through all those pretty quickly. I only died a couple times on each. Well, so uh, most of them I didn't even die on. Oh god. If you're wondering who that wonderful lady is, that's my girlfriend.
Oh my god! Oh, this annoys me. This annoys me very much. There's not much you can commentate on Anobi. I'm jumping over square triangle things. Ooh. Stage 18. What is this, a giant power strip? Recording for 16 minutes. It only took me 16 minutes to do this. Shocking. This is the longest strip of land I've ever gone across. Okay. Here we go, 20. Oh God. Seriously, there's like nothing to commentate on when I'm playing Obies, it's just like, really? Okay. So, I'm on. Surely you have more challenges. Seriously. Oh, she's on the pink maze. One of the most horrible parts. Stage 23. Okay. Oh, dear. Now, here's something I didn't... I, I didn't figure out. Yes, I have played this before. If you haven't already guessed that, you're probably stupid. How would I have done this so fast and know all these things? It's because I've done this one before. Just thought it would make a good bid. And I was right. 
Yeah, you just jump over this crap. It's really not that hard. You'll get killed a couple times, but whatever. Or you might just pass through it. Nobody knows. You might just be a god at this stuff. I swear my dog almost killed me. She's like moving around. Go! Yeah, that is how you beat that. Yes. Yeah. All right. Jump up the tower. Of power. You know, it's making me pissed off. I watch a YouTube channel called Watch Manager, and all their lists just piss me off. They're so judgmental. Like, I watched their run for top 10 movies based off of video games, and I liked the most of the movies on there. They had a Doom from 2005. I know a lot of people didn't like that movie, but I enjoyed it very much. I really did enjoy that movie. I honestly, to God, enjoyed that movie. And then it had House of the Dead on there, which I know House of the Dead had the worst acting you could possibly have in a movie, but I just enjoyed it nonetheless. It was a good action movie. I had a fun time watching it. And then it had a... Uh, I understand why uh, Laura Croft 2 was on there. That was not a good movie. I will admit that. And Mortal Kombat Annihilation. It had bad acting. It just had a horrible story. I mean, I had some fun seeing Jax beat up Sector, but other than that, it wasn't that great. Mortal Kombat 1 was awesome, though. And then I know why Street Fighter was on there. That was not a good movie. Trust me, I know. I own it. Don't judge, I do own the movie. And then... Um... And then, uh, what else was on there? There was, um... I also enjoyed House of the Dead, too, so why don't you guys just shut up? I enjoyed those movies. I enjoyed all of them. Yeah, but there was also, uh, all the Resident Evil movies were on there. The Resident Evil movies are, like, my favorite film series of all time. I'm not joking. I freaking love those movies. Oh my god, they're just so entertaining. They have a great story, and I love the animated ones, but not as much. The live action ones, I don't care what anybody says, but I freaking love those movies, I do. It's just like, Resident Evil movies, they're, they're freaking amazing. What don't you like about them? I've played the game, I know what it's like. I know it's not going by the game, but who gives a shit? I love them. They have a great story. Forget the game. If everything was based off of what it's based off of, it'll just be like watching the game and theatrical version. It's stupid. It's retarded. I want to see the actual move. I want to. I want to see like a actual different storyline. I freaking love those movies. People are just stupid and uh, dead or alive. Dead or Alive was a crappy movie, I admit. And then another movie I liked that was on there was The Wizard. The Wizard from 1982, or whatever it was. The, the Wizard movie. I freaking love that movie. I grew up with that. Well, my dad showed it to me. I only grew up in 2000, but I still loved it. I love that movie. People are retarded. Now, I I will accept Super Mario Bros. I didn't like that movie. It was horrible. Thank you. And one more that pissed me off. One more that pissed me off. Max Payne. 
I loved Max Payne. I don't care what anyone says. I don't give a shit about your opinion. I loved Max Payne. That movie was good to me. I really enjoyed Max Payne. I own it on DVD if you would like to see. I have Doom on DVD. I have all five of the Resident Evil. I have that. I have both Laura Croft movies. I have everything I just said. Plus more. Including the Far Cry movie. Don't ask me why I have Far Cry because it was bad. Just don't ask me. I, I just realized I ranted for like 10 minutes. Okay. Okay. I give up. I'll stop. Remember to leave a comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll be back here with more Silent Hill today, supposedly. Or, I'll be back here with another Roblox stream, or Secrets of Roblox stream, or maybe even a Roblox Tycoon. It will be one of those. Or maybe I won't even post at all. So remember to leave a comment, like, and subscribe, or I'll come to your house and rape you. I'm not going to comment on that last part.